what's up guys welcome to this new video now into this video we're going to be looking at google sites pros and cons okay so i've been making a lot of videos right here on my channel about google sites and some people have asked me what are the pros and cons of google sites right here in this video i'm going to answer all those questions for you i'm going to show you some of the good uh, which are the pros and some of the bad which are the cons of google sites now starting with the pros okay now one of the good pro of google site is it is very simple to use now google site is very 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 simple to use now all you just need to do on google site is just for you to know how to drag and drop so just drag stuff and drop it so let for example let's say i want to add uh a box here i just need to drag this stuff and drop it here and i can add images once i click on this stuff right now i can add images videos and anything i want to add right here and if i don't like the way this thing is looking i can decide to bring it bring it here and everything will be swapped and i can decide to group them together very very simple just drag and drop as far as you know drag and drop now those are the that's one pro of google sites another one is you can easily embed um codes just simple embed code and you can do some other stuff right here and since it's owned by google you can easily integrate anything you want to integrate without needing any plugin or anything so you can add youtube videos directly simple you can add buttons you can add image correction you can add dividers placeholders anything you want to add right here it's here on google sites okay that's some of the that's one pro of google site now another pro of google sites is once you're using google sites then you don't need to worry about web hosting because google is going to host everything right here for you so everything all the site you're going to be creating with google site is going to be hosted on your google drive which is which, the, which you have 15 gigabyte of free storage space okay so google is generous enough to give us 15 gig space for free guys that is huge okay that's huge so that's one or that's another major pro of using google site now with that with that uh, amount of space you can create any amount of site as you can see i have so many sites here on google site right here and i'm not even paying for hosting in any of this site so that's one that's another pro of using google site another pro which is not so technically true because i'm going to show you exactly why i said it is because you if you're using google site you have a good chance or you have a fair chance of ranking your website on google especially if you didn't connect a custom domain name if you're just using sites.google.com because the domain authority of sites.google.com is way good because um it's google products now if you don't know what domain authority is domain authority is how google sees your website okay so but if you, if you want to make it more professional you need to connect a custom domain name to your google site if you don't know how to do it don't worry i taught you exactly or i teach you exactly how to do it in this video called how to connect custom domain with google site it's very very self-explanatory and you're not going to go wrong if you watch this video so that's another pro now let's talk about the cons of using google site now one of the con or one of the major con of using google sites is you are limited to the kind of features you 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 have okay so uh let's say with the with site builder like wordpress the sky is just the starting point to what you can do with wordpress now i can decide to create a membership i can decide to create a social media website i can do a lot of things with wordpress that i can't do right here on google sites now you can only do simple stuff right here on google sites and uh, another another con of google site is this is not the industry standard okay so you are only to use google site if you're just creating something small or something not too big just lightweight very simple uh sites just very very simple then you can use google sites but if you want to make it more professional you want to be able to add plugins integrate different functions have your website do a lot of things then you should use wordpress or some other solutions google site is not for you if you're having those intentions so that's one of the cons of google sites now another con of google sites is you don't have access to the source code of this website all you're just saying is this stuff okay so you don't have um access to the code okay like unlike on wordpress or other you know ones you have access to the code and um you can for this site um you you, you can easily um add um some other um 
integrations for example you can't easily integrate adsense with this site just because you don't have the code source code so you can um, add adsense ads to this site but with other solutions like wordpress the reason why i'm mentioning wordpress is it is the industry standard okay so with wordpress you can add your source code you can you have the full control of the website and you can do a lot of things if fact, anything you want to do with it okay so that's another con now another con of google site is um there are limits like you have a lot of limits to what you can do like i think i've said it before uh let's say with wordpress you can add the integrations have so so many that i can't even overemphasize on it like you can add payment gateways you can integrate woocommerce you can uh, you know do a lot of magic with wordpress that you that you can't do here on google site you can only do simple stuff like i said simple basic stuff right here on google site for so simple site a simple buy or sell site a simple site about yourself a company just very simple and you're going to make sure is not is a site that is not going to get a whole lot of traffic just site with decent or a little amount of traffic so that um, there won't be any issues okay so those are some of the pros and cons of course there are so so many pros and cons of google sites that i think i haven't talked about but if you wanted if you want me to talk about talk about it more tell me in the comment section i just wanted you to i just wanted to hit out um some of these pros and cons so that you will know and if you ask me personally which one would i recommend i'll say if you have the money to set up a wordpress website of course which is not so much very very um affordable just get a domain name and hosting then i say you must use wordpress please okay so that you know you are you are you are dealing with the industry standard and not only dealing with the industry standard you have room to um integrate a whole lot of things and um, the sky is just the starting point for you if you're using wordpress okay but if you don't have that money you just want to make sure you start up without any excuse then you can use google sites if you want to create an e-commerce store with google site i've done the video for you it's on my channel go check it out this video here will guide you it has over thirty thousand views as of the time i'm making this video it's going to guide you okay so if that's it okay so if you if you can afford um, wordpress then go to wordpress straight up if you don't if you can't afford it then you can use google site but make sure and bear it in mind that you have some limits and um when it's time you need to upgrade to the industry standard which is wordpress okay um i believe you enjoyed this video please if you do subscribe turn on the bell icon so that you won't miss any other video once i drop them on this channel and guys please make sure you are see if you didn't subscribe to my channel or if you haven't subscribed to my channel you're not doing me good though i need to grow this channel please make sure to subscribe and turn on the bell icon so uh if you need more pros and cons on google sites tell me in the comment section so that i'll make it very detailed and i'll show you all of them uh, you know on the on, on the next video so i just wanted to highlight this one so that you will know what you're dealing with and uh, know exactly if it's for you or not so i'll see you guys in the next video stay blessed subscribe and i'll see you guys next time thank you very much